sometimes I get home from a busy day and I want something warm and beautiful, but I don't want to spend ages doing it and I don't want to go to the supermarket. So today I'm using all pantry items that you would have at home to make a gorgeous warm hummus soup. We're just gonna chop up the garlic just really roughly because we will be finishing it at the end with a stick blender. Now, this soup is very, very simple. And usually what I would do is that I would actually just chuck all the ingredients into a pot and let it simmer away. But to add a little bit of flavor today, I'm actually gonna fry off the garlic a little bit first so it's softened and it's really fragrant. This dish is so simple, so quick, all of 10 minutes, and it is literally like a warm hug. So while the garlic is cooking off, I'm gonna grab some of these beautiful herbs. I've got some mint and some parsley here. I'm just gonna give them a very, very rough chop and throw them in the garlic. This is the base of all of your flavors. I can start to smell the garlic now, so in goes my herbs. The sound that you can hear that's popping is the moisture from the herbs kind of evaporating and cooking off. Now chickpeas can go straight through. Stir them up. Just so the garlic doesn't burn. This does add a lot of flavour. Next up I've got a lemon which I'm just going to zest in to give a really fresh kick. And the juice of about a third of a lemon or half, depending on how juicy your lemons are. Some vegetable stock. All we want to do is to get that to the boil and then leave it to simmer by turning it down a little bit for five minutes. So that's come to a boil now. I'm just going to turn it down to a simmer, have a quick taste to see how it's going. Mm. Add a tiny bit of salt because it does need some salt. I didn't want to do that at the beginning because I didn't know how the stock would react and see if it, if it reduces too much it might get salty but I'm happy with it so that's how it's gonna stay for about five minutes and then we'll blitz it up. That's been simmering for five minutes now I'm just gonna turn the heat off. It's looking beautiful. Get my stick blender. It's gonna go straight in. We're gonna blend. All right, that's beautiful and smooth now. If you like your soups a little bit thicker, feel free to pour a little bit of that liquid out because it will help with the consistency. But for me, I want this to be quite loose, really warming. So we're just gonna spoon that into a beautiful bowl here. Serve it with some Greek yogurt, just to add a little bit more creaminess to it and a little bit of acidity. A couple of dollops of the Greek yogurt. You mix that in yourself after. Some of Elena's beautiful dukkha will also go on top. I do love all of the beautiful spices in there. A little bit of black pepper. Some of these herbs, just for a little bit of garnish. I will give them a little chop. I'm gonna serve that with some flatbread that our wonderful food technician slash Kitchen Mama, Joe has made, just for dipping. If you don't have any flat bread, you can definitely just use normal bread. Really warming, really comforting. Took less than 10 minutes and all with pantry staples at home. This is my warm hummus soup. Give it a go for yourself.